At a court in Florida on Monday, 58-year-old Ryan Wesley Ruth was given two gun charges, one of possessing a firearm whilst a convicted felon and the second of obliterating the serial number on that firearm. Uh, the two charges could be the first of many that could be heading his way as the investigation into the attempted assassination of Donald Trump continues. We are learning more details, however. The Secret Service on Monday saying that Ryan Wesley Ruth fired no shots towards the president, but instead those gunshots were indeed from Secret service heading his way, which caused him to flee the scene. Donald Trump has laid blame for this attempted assassination at the feet of the Democrats and Joe, Joe Biden and Kamala Harris in particular, saying that the rhetoric coming from the Democrats feels that makes people feel emboldened to make the bullets start flying. Well, Joe Biden and Kamala Harris have said that there is no space for political violence in America. And we got word from the White House on Monday that Donald Trump received a phone call from Joe Biden. Uh, the official readout from the White House said President Biden spoke with former President Trump and conveyed his his relief that he is safe. The two shared a cordial conversation and former President Trump expressed his thanks for the call.